So guys, I'm back, and right now we are just wiring it up. So we got this cable right here, and it's inside the LNB on here. And we put a terminating resistor on the other little connector because we're only using one connector right now. And yeah, here's all my parts. We got this satellite finder right here. Got this battery pack. Got a whole bunch of batteries. We got these. RF choke. RF chokes. And we have another terminating resistor. And yeah, here's inside this again. Right there. Here you go. Here's our resistor. And here's the cable. Put that. And it just goes inside like that. Just like that. Okay, so guys, here's my soldering iron or soldering station right here. I'll open it up and show you. Okay, so here's the power supply thing for the soldering iron, solder, tip, soldering iron, solder sucker. Yeah, I'm gonna bring it over here. I'm gonna set it all up. What's up, guys? I'm back, and I just set up the soldering station. So, here's the power supply right here. I'll turn it on and show you guys. There you go. And here's the actual soldering iron. And we're wet sponge right here to wipe solder off the soldering iron because sometimes it gets stuck on there and it's really annoying. Got our tips right here, our solder, so we're gonna need that. And we have our solder sucker, just in case we mess something up. And got it plugged into this extension cord. That runs all the way over there. Hey guys, I'm back. I just filled up my big battery container right here. And I just put this little nine volt connector on it that we were doing off the internet. And so, um, give some credit to Procedure for making the itty bitty telescope. I think that's, I don't know. There's a website right there. If you guys want to build them yourself. And yeah, we just we just connected this to right here. And we connected one of these on to here. And the other end of the other cord that we had. And here's the soldering station again. Might have to do a little bit of soldering. So yeah, I think this thing's going to work out pretty good. Coax is like a two wires. There's a copper wire in the middle, and then there's a white insulator with a protective sheathing, and then there's this wire on the outside with the two conductors. It's like two wires in one. So our coax is just a type of cord, like the one that you guys probably use at your house to get cable. Unless you have satellite TV. Yeah. So there, we're separating it, and we're gonna solder an inductor on there. Look what I found. You know what this is? Okay, so guys, right now, we're just gonna solder an inductor onto the end of this. And if you forgot, this is what they look like right here. Little tiny things. So yeah, I'll get to soldering. Okay, so guys, if you didn't know what these are for, they're to block the interference from the batteries to the radio telescope. So just if you're curious, that's what they're for. Hey, so guys, sorry I can't film me soldering because I need two hands to solder, but I'll make sure to show you it when we're done. Okay, so we hooked up the RF choke to the positive wire, and this is gonna go to ground wire right here. So it'll go right here under this wire. Something like that. This is the ground wire right here. There. 
and we just soldered this wire under that wire. Focus. So yeah, we just soldered those wires together. So yeah, see you in the next. Or I'll see you when we do some more wiring. Also, if you're gonna try doing this, make sure you wrap up your connections with electrical tape because uh, these are live wires and you don't want to shock yourself. And also electrical tape helps it from shorting out. So guys, just showing you again what's inside one of these types of wires. So I just cut a little groove in it. And as I peel it open, you can see it's all all the small wires are wrapped around one big huge wire. And I feel it open a little bit more for you guys. So yeah, I can see it better right there. So that's how those cords are made. Okay, so guys, we just finished soldering. We have all the parts soldered up in there and wired up. So this is our radio telescope right here. It's all finished now, and I am just gonna connect this. Connect it all and mount it. Connect that on there. And so I'm gonna put this into here. Tighten it up a little bit more. Okay, so it's all connected. And I got all this right here. Okay, so guys, because this might not work inside, we might have to go outside and test it. And right now, we're just currently mounting our little battery packs on here like this. And got, our, got everything mounted on. Have it all wired up. Got our little setup vendor right here. And yeah, let's go outside and test it. Okay, so guys, it doesn't work outside right now because it's nighttime outside right now. But I promise tomorrow I'll put a video of me testing it outside and showing it reading some things like the sun, me, trees. But that was just a mini build video of the radio telescope. So, hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share it with your friends. Let's get a thumbnail. So yeah, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share it with your friends. If you liked it, make sure you tap the like button. So, yeah guys, see you in the next video. Bye!